Oh shit, Fair Strife! What's up guys, it's Fair Strife here. I'm gonna teach you guys how to level up your Slayer level, your Behemoth level, your weapons, and your armor. There are four ways you can do it, okay? Only three that I do. Master your Behemoth and your weapons, right? So in order to level up your Master and your Behemoth, it's by upgrading all the armors to plus six, plus ten, and then wearing them when you fight the same Behemoth. That's, that's one way. And also another way to level your mastery is to use all your weapons. Level them as far as you can to plus six or plus ten and use them in battle and experience. That way it's the fastest way to do it that I know of. See, as for me, I'm working on Mastery Beast. And I got this one a plus 15 already, this weapon here, Amber Pipe. And I'm working on some more as we still go. I, eh, God Hand, you know, everyone knows about the God Hand experience. I maxed that one out, no problem. Eh. You complete all three bars like that, you get experience. You keep using it, and you still get more experience. And it helps you level up your, your Slayer and your, and your Mastery for your weapon. So, the more you progress, the more better you be. It's not that hard. It's not that easy. It's just grind, grind, grind. I'm gonna show you what. I'm gonna show you what the grind looks like. This is what the grind looks like. Most of the grind you'll probably get this shit right here. Here, these dull arc stones. You like the color? Like, hey, can you help me with my those arc stones? So, whatever you prefer, whatever weapon smith you prefer, whatever weapon you like to craft, stay in that section. Master it out. See, I went everywhere. I'm a bad, I'm a bad person. See, look at that. I went everywhere. You know, I should have stayed with one zone. Cause if you don't, you're gonna get this crap. Sixteen shining arch stones. Then you got this one. Sixteen shining arch stones. Then this one. Thirty-six shining arch stones. And then you got this one. Oh, upgrade. Anyways. We're not going to upgrade that one yet because I need those. I need these dual ox stones. And then you're going to get these. See, so you got to grind 50. 46? Woo! That's a hell of a mother sucker, huh? That grind is real. You got to do... Wait, am I on that weapon? Okay, you got to shroud. Well, I haven't created that one yet. Yeah, he's a pain in the ass. Uh, then you need five frost. You need thirty-six more. Shiny. So that's just to make it. That's just to make it a plus nine. See, that is crazy sauce. So this one, you know, already maxed that level out. You know what I'm saying? There's no nothing to it. As you can see, I maxed the level weapon out on the Ember Main. See, plus fifteen. So. You know, it happens, and then, you know, the grind gets realer after six plus. There's usually two crafts. The first craft, and then when you're about to hit plus six, they give you another craft build where you got to get all the parts. And after that, you should just be duels and shinings and duels and shinings. But sometimes there is a third craft, like this bastard right here, the God Hand. You know, I got, I got, all I gotta do now is peerless arc stones, but, yeah, you know how hard that crap is. That shit is so hard to get peerless stones, man, you, you gotta grind, grind, grind. Yeah. And them behemoths, they're not that easy, I'm telling you. You know, and then you, you know, you get exotic weapons, you know, it's not, it's, it's not too bad, I mean. See, to me, you get a plus six, I need to fight Shroud again. I gotta take his head out. Hey, you know how hard that is? Well, not a great team out there. That is super hard. I'm telling you now. That is, woo! That's hell of a battle. And you gotta hammer. But the best way, best way to do it, dude, be honest with you guys, dude, girls, guys, whoever plays Dauntless, just level everything you can. Craft them all up. Craft, 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 craft. That's all you gotta do. Play with them. Play with them. That's all you gotta do. Play with every weapon you can, and it'll level this mastery right here real quick. Plus, 
you level your mastery on your weapons, and then for Behemoth, though, you got to do your armor set. So that's the only way to level Behemoth. I mean, you can go through weapons. I mean, it works. Like, you get plus 6 or plus 10, and you play with it. I mean, it does help, but the fastest way that I know is just by leveling up your armor. Make, take them all to plus 10. All to plus 10. That's all you got to do. And then once you do that, boom, you get level up off of three armors. Easy. Easy peasy. As you can see, one, I got I got to do this one. So I got to take that plus one. But look at the grind. 16 shines, two radiant Arthur gems. And then look at this one. Six peerless, six peerless, six peerless, six shinings, arch stones, and cross three terror orbs. Look at this one. Five peerless. Three shining, five peerless, so many peerless, oh my god. And then this one, one shining, one shining, one shining, that's not too bad. This one, five peerless, five peerless, five peerless, <sighs> eleven shining, two terrors, two terrors, you know, that's not bad, that's not bad, but that's a long way from level 10. And then you got Pegnar, Frost, and then this one. I can upgrade that one, but I'm not wasting nothing right now. You know, it's just a hell of a grind every day and day out. So, anyways, I hope this video helped out, or it might have been confusing, because I'm a very annoying person. Anyway, hope this helped you out, guys. And, um, happy hunting. Sure. If you're Stryfer here, make sure you guys subscribe, like, and comment on my shit. Because it does help. And I want to help me grow, I help you grow. Understand? Alrighty. Catch you guys later.